guys, today I am going to show you an easy rustic French loaf, a slow room temperature fermented method. Oh my, you gotta try that. Slightly different method than in my last easy homemade French baguette video. This one offers sensational results as well. Good bread takes time, so let's get started. Combine water, flour, salt, yeast and molasses together and knead for about 4 minutes. That's all. Then form a ball and transfer the dough into a non-greased plastic container to rise. The dough should be around 83 degrees Fahrenheit, 28 degrees Celsius. Now let the dough rise at room temperature for 4 hours. During the resting time, gently deflate the dough every hour, so 3 times using water instead of flour to prevent sticking. Indeed, good bread takes time, but it does not take time from you. And while you wait for your bread to rise, you can do the 101 other things you want to do. Deflating the dough after it rises releases the carbon dioxide built up in the dough and relaxes the gluten. The dough is also developing flavor during this long fermentation process. That's what we are looking for. It smells just fabulous. My dear friends, the rising time is over. To shape your round loaf, begin by gently pressing down the dough without deflating it, except larger bubbles. Draw up the edges to the center, turn dough over, draw the dough down with cupped hands to slightly tighten the skin, rotating the dough back and forth using a circular motion. Gorgeous. Let it proof for about an hour and a half. And by the way, this recipe makes excellent baguette as well. So what is the secret to French baguette? Well, watch the easy homemade French baguette video and you'll see what I am talking about. Once risen, unmold and transfer loaf to an upside down baking tray or bread peel dusted with fine semolina, slash and carefully slide onto the hot baking tray or pizza stone and bake for 55 minutes. For centuries, French villages had communal ovens, where the townsfolk would bring their dough to be baked. Today, you can make it at home. The real deal is now your favorite cooking channel. I am Bruno Albuz. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.